the blue moon that happened yesterday and the last few days in my recovery from COVID I really feel like we are being opened up to receive higher energies that are parts of our souls but perhaps we weren't ready to receive them until now. I feel there's A significant significant portal opening in our timeline I felt like almost like a walk-in but it wasn't a walk-in but I could feel parts of the monad your monad is your you have your soul you have your higher self you have your oversoul your monad is like the soul soul and I felt like that expanded closest to source energy that I am I felt like that was being poured into me as I was managing the fever and the pain I felt like my ear chakras my throat chakra my heart chakra like <laughs> being pushed out bigger and brighter and lighter and that required incredible rest and reflection integration I'm sharing this with you because I know many of you are going through this as well either through getting some kind of illness or sickness or whether it's just you're feeling fatigue all the time your sleep is disturbed heart palpitations I went through the list of these evolutionary also known as ascension symptoms in my energy updates for August part one two three and four and I feel like I'm sharing this with you because it is significant and you are going to feel a sigh of relief you're going to feel a shift on the first or second or third of September especially the first and second there's something about that that time where the slowdown of August is going to rapidly externally show up in your life now like I said in my August energy update part one these are complex frequencies and energetic signatures that we have not digested and metabolized before that will take its toll in respect to how how deep and how far and wide we are open to receiving at this time it's a great time to receive August and September and as I said things will seem slow on the surface at this time but underneath there's actually a lot happening and I, I remember as I channeled that part one I talked about I was given not before as I was channeling in the video I was shown the image of a swan looking so graceful and beautiful floating down the stream floating down the river and then you look underneath the water and you see the the legs shuffling away and working away to to keep the swan moving, flowing down this river. That's really been the energy of late. It looks like there's nothing happening, but trust me, if you look underneath the surface level of things, 
there is so much happening and we are being prepared and we are being tenderized for tremendous change individually as well as collectively as a as a social construct in my stretches this morning i was shown the colors and the textures of the frequency that i call innocence and it was such a beautiful download I feel like this blue moon is connected to innocence and I feel like the weeks that follow are connected to if we go back to around the age of seven I'm getting six or seven there's events that happened around that time or there's memories from that time and there's something about how we interpreted the events or circumstances of our childhood around that time and how moving forward we can we can tweak that now we get to tweak the timeline moving forward and i really feel like the start of september will begin to show external circumstances and situations and synchronistic events to reflect back to us how we have changed and how our new choices and our re-emergence into this innocence is going to play out in our lives now so think of your beautiful innocent inner child think of your childhood when life was fun and life was light and the energy of that and how you can make decisions and choices that pull back in that beautiful, tender, vulnerable, pure innocence. And that maybe at that time something happened or you experienced something unpleasant that made you feel unsafe in the world or tainted what you thought was your innocent heart and energy. And having a chance now to see that differently and to decide that your innocence is still intact because it is your purity your power i'm claiming that now and i claim that with you as your healer as your shaman as your angel channel and so it is the light in me recognizes and sees the light in you i see you <laughs>